Hey guys, this is Lowe with the Polished Edge. So I got a pair of twins here. These are Yanagibas from Subazo. They're made in Japan. I believe they're stainless steel because, well, there's no rust. <laughs> Usually if it's carbon, you either see some patina or some rusting occurring. It's a little bit here, but yeah, it's kind of common with some stainless steels. So we're gonna do the full chisel grind sharpen uh, up to a high refinement on felt. All right, so let's get to it. Alright guys, so I've done one and I've left the other. I'm going to do a slight comparison of uh, before and after, I suppose. Uh, remember this is the new one. Uh, this is the one that was slightly sharpened, so I did this one first. So again, it's comparison, I guess you could say from the factory. Okay. Now the customer wanted a regular plus. Uh, what is regular plus? It is done on machine, uh, considered something like a regular edge, but I go through more belts and we get slightly better refinement, uh, slightly nicer mirror as well. If you can see that. Yeah, it, it looks it looks okay, maybe it'll look nice on camera, I don't know, but in person, it's a mirror, but it's slightly hazy, okay? Uh, that being said, it is a lot cheaper than having hand sharpen it to a mirror mirror. <laughs> Alright, so that's enough talking. Let's see how this guy cuts. I've got magazine taper here and we shall try some weird angle cuts. That is nice, nice wave. Bam! I really like uh, working with Yanagi Bass and Chisel Ground Blade because the edge that you get from them is actually really, really nice. Uh, right hand grind, right hand cut does well. Let's see how it does in a reverse cut. It's pretty good as well. I like this. Anyway, you can kind of see the difference. Of course, uh, that's a reflection of the camera in one and there, almost nothing in the other. It's quite a difference. All right, so that was the first one. Now this is the second one. <laughs> nice. Let's just do some curls. All right, yeah. <laughs> Sweet. All right, so let's do that heel to tip again. Okay, no problems. All right. I'm always sad that I have to give these knives back, but that's the way it is. <laughs> All right, so it's done, and we'll be packing this up and sending it off. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more knives, more sharpening videos. If you have any comments, just put down below or you can DM me direct as well if you have any questions. Anyways, till then, you guys stay safe and stay sharp. I'll catch y'all in the next video.